Hey guys, how are you doing? I hope you're doing great. Kamui here, and today is uh, Sonic the Hedgehog birth anniversary, birthday, whatever. <laughs> uh, I am a huge fan, you all know that, if you have seen my, my videos. And, well, today I'm going to do something a little different. We're gonna have a top 5 of the best stages from the first game for the Sega Genesis. Well, my opinion of the best 5 stages. So, let's do it. So, number 5. Labyrinth Zone. This stage is hated by a lot of people because, well, we have water and most of the platform games that had that had that has uh, sorry that has water levels um, people hate the water levels it's uh, it's really common <laughs> uh, well Sonic it's uh, well we can understand that because the gameplay gets slower you have to get those bubbles or else you die because he needs to breathe yeah and but the song of this stage the, the level design I, I really like i think it's different it gives a different pacing for for the game um slower pacing and this happens uh, okay this happens it has this horrible song i'm not gonna let you die sonic it's your birthday i need you to live more Yes. <laughs> so that's it. That's my fifth favorite stage from the game. Let's go to the other one. Number four. Scrap a zone. Scrap brain zone. Sorry. <laughs> this is the my my fourth favorite stage from the game. I love the music. I love the the the, the way this stage represents. Um, the madness of Dr. Robotnik, Dr. Eggman. Uh, the things that you can do, you have different paths to follow, uh, lots of things to find, and it's really nice, this technological stuff. And the music, the music is awesome, and it's a really hard stage. Uh, it looks like the final stage for the difficulty and the the, the scale of it, right? Because it's really big, really detailed. And that's it. That's the number four. Let's go to the next one. Number three. Starlight Zone. This day is really, really beautiful. Uh, the, 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 the song, the music is really calm, it's calmer than the others. Uh, it has a very different vibe to it. And you have these little bombs and you have like a scale stuff that you need to pull a ball, uh, jump and throw a ball and then make Sonic jump to the other side. It's, it's really, really different. Um, and it's my third favorite stage in the game. The first time that I played when I was a kid, I was really impressed uh, how the, the Sega Genesis, the Mega Drive, could handle the, the speed and the colors and the music. It, it was really something back then. And it's still something for me. Yeah, oh, I got it. <laughs> That's it, guys. This is my third favorite stage. Let's go to the other one. Number two. Let's see. Yes, pre-yard zone. It's my second favorite stage on the game. The first time I played, uh, I was amazed with the the music and the backgrounds and the the speedball stuff that you have in the stage. I'm not a big fan of the 
the casino stages in, in Sonic 2 and in the other Sonic games. But this is not really a casino stage, it's, it, it has elements of it. And I really, really like what they have done here. And then you have this little robot that looks like Sonic, and at the time, me and my friends, we thought it was like a prototype for uh, Metal Sonic. <laughs> Those crazy theories of the 90s. And that's it. That's my second favorite stage. Let's go to the first one. Number one! And of course, my favorite stage is Green Hill Zone, the first stage of Sonic the Hedgehog. And back at the time, it was really common for the first stages. Uh, the first stages used to be the, the best ones because we didn't have how to save, we only had some cheat codes and those stuff. But that's why I think they, they used to make the, the first stages completely awesome with the best song of the game or the best design and it, it really needed to, to call for, for the attention of the, the buyers, the gamers at that time because we didn't have Google, we didn't have YouTube, we didn't have so, so much information like now and as you can see it really shows the blast processing processor or whatever of the Genesis and the what the Genesis was capable of. And you have this really nice song, this classic song that everybody knows. Even if a person is not a fan of Sonic the Hedgehog or never played video games or don't understand about video games, they know the song is from Sonic. It's really it's really good. It's that good. And Sega always tries to create a new Green Hill and in Sonic 2, in Sonic 3 and in all the Sonic games you have like a Green Hill, a new Green Hill zone and that's it guys, thanks for watching happy birthday Sonic, I hope you still live long and make me happy like you always do Sonic is always gonna be my, my hero I have a tattoo of him uh, on my back here <laughs> one day I'll show it to you and that's it guys thanks for watching I hope you like it uh, tell me your favorite stages from the franchise or from the first on the game the second whatever uh, on the comments and that's it thanks for watching take care have a nice weekend see you next time